Imagine waking up from surgery and realizing the hospital that was supposed to heal you has done more harm than good. What if I told you one patient described it as the worst hospital in history? From being pumped full of fluids, leaving lasting damage months later, to being ignored by anesthesia staff, it's more than just bad care. It's a nightmare come to life. And if your loved ones don't speak perfect English, don't expect them to know what's happening during a 12-hour surgery. This is what one patient faced at Medical City Fort Worth. Want to know why they're urging others? Do not get surgery done here? Stay tuned for the full story. The worst hospital in history. I wish I could give zero stars. If you don't have family there with you, they could easily kill a person while recovering from surgery. You better not have any questions for them or you'll be treated very badly. After promising, they would provide information to my wife, who is still learning English in Spanish. My wife could not get any information during a 12-plus hour surgery. Apprehensible. If you're having surgery, good luck with the anesthesia staff. They won't pay attention to anything you have to say, nor will they take very good care with their responsibility. This place is even worse than I thought when I gave this first review. They pumped me full of fluids during my surgery, and I'm still retaining fluid two months later. Furthermore, the way they positioned to be on my stomach injured my neck and right leg. Do not get surgery done in this hospital. Don't even consider it. In a word, nightmare. Hearing stories like this one is a stark reminder of why it's important to stay informed about the quality of care at hospitals. If you've ever experienced anything like this, or if you know someone who has, please share your story in the comments below. Your voice could make a difference in raising awareness and ensuring better care for everyone. If you found this video eye-opening, don't forget to like and share it to spread the word. And for more stories that expose the realities of patient experiences and help you make informed decisions about healthcare, make sure to subscribe to our channel. Remember, staying informed is the first step to protecting yourself and your loved ones.